It's time for the return of Phil to Diamond. I know it's been nearly a day since we've had it, but I know you're eager for it. We're going to let the gods decide what we play today. We're still going to fill, but I'm going to use a highly um, sophisticated program to tell me and predict with almost 100% certainty what we're going to be getting. It's called Marbles. Uh, it's it's going to be Marbles. Okay, we're underway. Like... Buy merch and support are in the in the in the front lead here. Support seems to be in top spot right now. Just followed by like top is behind then. Subscribe, bot and mid are just below. Jungle and buy merch at the back, but there's still a lot to play for here today. They're going down the hole. Support's in the front spot. It's anyone's game. Support makes its way down. Like is there just after it. We've got some uh, top lane. Top lane's coming in behind real hard here. Buy merch disappointingly trailing right in the back here. <laughs> Unfortunate, but that's the way she goes, dude. It's really all a play for here. Honestly, it could be anyone's game. It could honestly be anyone's game right now. I can't believe it. <laughs> I can't believe it. He can't keep getting away with this. <laughs> he can't keep getting away with this. Top followed by like, subscribe, and then by merch. You know what to do. If you like this series at all and you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Buy some merch to support us at sortofpsycho.com. And also like the video. Let's see what we get. Let's see if this is going to be correct. Please don't be right. Please don't be right. Oh, I swear I was wrong, dude. I'm jungle. I can, I can handle that. Oh, yeah. Have I played any jungle games? I've played one game of Zack, actually. Um... Yeah, okay. I can live with this. I can live with this. Okay, we had great success with our man the last time. Let's go again. Let's go for him again. Okay, it's time to get into things. I can actually talk a little bit at the beginning of this as well because we're jungling, so there's a lot less, like, that I can mess up when I go on a tangent in the jungle because, let's be honest, the jungle camps are not going to do anything tremendously unpredictable, whereas when I'm in bot lane or when I'm in top lane... I end up just AFK pushing the wave, so much so that I end up getting zoned for and then dying before I even hit 10 CS. It's happened like eight times at this point, but now nah, I can't do it with this, so it's great. All I have to focus on is just try and keep an eye on lanes, make sure that I'm going to be able to like gank, or if something happens, I can counter gank it. But yeah, I hope you're having a great day. Uh, it's It was today, Friday, that we're, yeah, we, well, we, we pretty much just record these videos on the day that they're uploaded. You could say that that's poor forward planning, but... I like to give the authentic experience. I, I think that people, well, I don't know. Maybe we'll record a couple. Maybe, I don't know what we're going to do today. But I, I like to try and not go too far ahead with the Phil of Diamond because like, it's a bit of a spoiler. Someday. I mean, I guess like if you're interested to watch it and see how it progresses, you're not going to look up like my match history or my LP or my profile on League. But just like the people that, you know, want to spoil it and find out what the up-to-date progress is, uh... I guess they can. They don't really care one way or the other. But for the most part, like, you know, I try and keep it as, like, close to the wire as possible. Mostly because I'm pretty lazy and World of Warcraft is destroying my life. And secondly, because I think it makes it a better experience. It's like, you're never quite sure what it's going to be on. Yeah, World of Warcraft has been entirely destroying my life. And I'll tell you why. So there's this mount called the uh, the Brutusaur in Battle for Azeroth, right? Battle for Azeroth is not an expansion that I enjoyed in any fashion, right? Well, I start I liked the start of it, and then it got kind of bad, and then, you know, I kind of, like, fell out of love with it, and I've been just getting back into it because Shadowlands looks pretty good, the new expansion. But uh, the Brutusaur is a mount that has an auction house on it, and it costs 5 million gold, dude. And I have been grinding. I have been grinding to try and earn enough money to make it because they're taking it out at the end of this expansion. It, it costs 5 million million gold and as of now i'm I, to be fair i'm quite close i'm, I'm only about four million nine hundred and seventy five thousand gold away which is pretty close <laughs> when you think about it it's actually not too bad am i ray okay am i saying that if you want to mail gold is that is this is this desperate is this super desperate what i'm doing right now am i saying that if you have an extra 10 gold in your bank in silverman eu that you should send it to Knobhead, the name on screen. I am a nice little gnome. I'm an, I never hurt anyone. I'm a healer. I'm a disciplined priest. I'm just trying to make my way in the world. Then I'm just saying that I I uh, wouldn't say no to such a thing. Anyway, back to the thing. Right, we hold on. We're selling it right now. We're selling it on World of Warcraft of all things. What else do we say? Uh, subscribe. What else do we say? Uh, stop following me on TikTok as well. 400 of you follow me on TikTok after I briefly mentioned it in the last video. Uh, I am too old for that app, I think. 
I, I thought it was I could just post my old Vine videos and stupid stuff that I make in my spare time. But it is actually a Zoomer, a Zoomer toolkit and I don't understand it. <laughs> I fully don't know what I've gotten myself in for with TikTok and what after I briefly mentioned it like 400 people followed me and that's really cool uh, but at the same time I don't know what I'm doing uh, and I feel like it's a danger to myself and those around me if I use them any <laughs> anyway <laughs> uh, okay we, we told people to not do that the merch yeah that too get that going if you're interested in a fresh as frig hoodie then by all means right hold on we're gonna go in this right we're actually gaming now Yeet! Got I got I got jumped around there. She's gonna flash. I didn't really I didn't know if that was gonna kill her or not. I didn't want to risk it. Didn't want to risk it, dude. They're really a nose. They're really a nose. I don't like that. See, this is bad, right? So the the series has gotten a decent amount of traction over the last like little bit. I don't know, man. I feel like maybe I could be. I'm not trying to say it's corporate espionage that you know my teammates know and they're intentionally making me play bad. But if that's an excuse that I could use, then I think it's one that I want to use. Right. This is an an uh um uh what well, uh, a twisted fate, ADC. I'm not quite sure how I would feel about that. Yumi has abandoned ship. Uh, it's a double pick for Ross. Oh, yeah, 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 dude. You're probably a dragon. It's Karthus, so I think we're pretty safe as far as it goes. Maybe slightly risky, but we'll see how we, how we, how we do this. I'm trying to get my blobs as much as I can. I'm kind of struggling a little bit with the tanking aspect of this, but I think we've got it pretty solidly. Okay, dude, we got it. Infernal Dragon, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. An excellent start, 2-0. Granted, I think I probably should have given it to, um, I probably should have given it to, like, Ezra or something. But I'll, I'll be honest with you, I, I didn't see a flash come out. And the amount of times when I played jungle that I have left, or I've attempted, I should say, to leave a kill for one of my laners. And then, you know, they don't want to pop flash. They think it's a free kill. I don't want to pop flash because I don't want to steal it. What happens? They get away. They get away and then now we're in a bad position. I, I and it, They still get gold, uh, so maybe it's greedy or maybe it's just me. I, I'm just trying to cover my- I'm trying to cover- make sure everybody at least gets some gold. I don't think Zach with money is a bad thing inherently, so uh, it's just- it is what it is. Like, in that lane as well, like, I, I'm pretty sure that Aurelia would have died to Ignite, but at the same time, oh, sh sh I, you know. She could have popped the Corrupting Pot and it could have kept her alive on that last tick and nobody likes to see someone- survive on the last tick of ignite it's just not worth it we're level five but with 1300 hp for comparison our bot lane have 800 <laughs> our mid laners got quite a lot actually but they are two levels higher than me so it kind of doesn't really count i'm thinking like bot lane just looks absolute extra spicy it's an absolute it's an extra spicy chicken zinger burger from kfc that's it's looking very nice right always oh, going down who's gonna die from that nobody died from it it was just oh actually go on ezreal go on my son you got this gangster. Oh, he's actually nailed it. He nailed it, mate. Stellar effort all around. Two for one. Grant, uh, it wasn't even Karthus that got the pick either, which is really, really excellent. And it was Ezreal that got the picks. Oh, well, Ezreal got one. So it's like, that's, that's, that's fine. I'm coming in on this mid lane. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, we're two zero one. That's pretty pog. I'm liking it. Jungle is a role that I think, like, with, with this particular character, at the very least, I can at least be vaguely useful on. The enemy are begging for mercy. But I will not be the one to give it today. Right, how's top lane doing? 0-1 ahead in CS. Not too shabby. I do want to... Never mind. <laughs> Shouldn't have said anything. We will need to help top lane. Not because I think that it's a lane worth helping, but because what we need to do is we need to maintain Teemo's uh, mental attitude. It's, it's literally the entire point of playing jungle, I reckon. It's like sometimes you have to take the L so that your team, you know, don't have their mental go boom. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Aurelia is not having a good time, dude. That was a really nice wall from uh, the Anivia there. Oi. Dude. Okay, flash there. Okay. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. I can't! Oh. <laughs> we did. oh, dude, we need to get out of here now. We need to get out of here. Oh, man. This is going very well. I'm 204. 
Our Nevia is 4 and 0, which is very good for your Nevia. A late game champion, a very positive early on in the game, is very epic. That being said, the enemy team has a Karthus, so let's not like count them out just yet. Alright, so our bot lane got their tower. We uh, are mid lane, we, I mean, they're pushing down mid lane right now. I probably would want to go help that out just to make sure that everything's going to be okay. Hold their hands. Tell them everything's going to be fine. Uh, I, I'm going to say that's probably not dive worthy. They have a Yumi. I, actually, that's super duper dive worthy. I tell a lie. That's fine. We just back up, get tower. All good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, pathing was pretty bad there. Okay. Our bot lane are really good. Our mid lane is really good. Our top lane is in the game. And at the end of the day, isn't that all you can ask for? Our top lane hasn't said anything, which I would abs I'll take nine times out of ten. Like, they haven't flamed, they haven't complained. And like, yeah, he's not doing amazingly. But as, as, so as far as I can tell, he's not frustrated enough that he's taking it to team chat. And the last thing I need, right, is... Our mid laner who's doing well, getting tilted off of a Teemo flaming or complaining. Or my bot lane getting really frustrated and annoyed with the Teemo because he's complaining. Or me getting awfully frustrated and annoyed that he's not asking, that he's asking for ganks. I am not immune to tilt. It has happened once. It'll happen again. It's time to back off. I don't think we fight these. Or we wait for Anivia. Actually, we just leave. Yeah! We need the whole squad. We need the whole gang. 680 smite. Okay, interesting inv interesting going there. Not uh, not amazing. Wow. Uh, okay. Well, Yumi Ulti down. I think Yumi Ulti is a much bigger Ulti than mine. So, I'll, you know what? If we're going to trade Ulti for Ulti, mine's going to be off cooldown fairly soon anyway again. It's not a big deal. However, something can definitely happen within that short space of time that would allow us to, to, to get on her without that Ulti being up. Uh, I'm gonna maybe I'm gonna try and hold bot if, if they want to push mid. That's absolutely totally uh, absolutely as yeah go just go for it. I am just gonna try. I mean they backed off probably held mid, but I can clear this super duper easy. And I want to get myself my warmog. Warmogs. We're gonna go spirit massage next because we're into that carcass. We're into that Yumi. We're into that twisted fate for some reason that I'm not sure on. But yeah, we got our three KHP, which is fantastic. Uh, we now got warmogs rock and rolling. We're a Big boy. We picked. Wait, wait. Did I pick up Harold? I thought Brand did. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I thought Brand picked up the Harold, dude. It was apparently me. That's that. That is what it is. That really does show you how much I've been trying to ward. That being said, yeah, okay, the ward's not been amazing, but like, you know, we're kind of just we're kind of just doing our thing. Yeah. Oh, he down. Now we ulti. We're gonna try and block the ulti off. He's fine, he lived. We can back it up a little bit. We got we got the uh, Warmog's gonna proc. Uh, it's proc in now. I've got a Yumi too, but it's actually a vest. Morello and Omicron first item off Karthus. Kind of actually fairly smart. That's good, that's probably gonna be a pick. Yay! Uh, I really ulti meant down. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I'm zooming. <laughs> I'm perma zooming, dude. That, that, that's a dead Aurelia for sure. Go on. Yeet. Catch him. He's been sold. He's not getting away, dude. Yeet. <laughs> he's trying to get away, dude. He's a 1 in 8 Twisted Fate ADC. Dude, he's going AP, actually. Man, I don't know why you would do that, but there you go. I'm back to full HP. I'm 5 1 6. I'm having a blast. There's oh my. I would even accept jungle again. I had a very, very enjoyable game. I had a blast. All right, I just need to try and block block this off somewhat. Try and not let him get ulted. Okay, he is super dead. And you know what? I think I might join him. Although, yeah! Timo, push it up, brother. <laughs> Timo, come on, man. Oh, wait, it's not even the menu wave isn't even there. Okay. Timo is a non-factor this game. It's actually kind of embarrassing. Pull him back, brother. Ooh. Block off his potential ultimate. He's dead. Yeah, get on her. Punch that cat. Where's Charlie? I want to give him a pet. I hate I hate Yumi in this game. It just makes me appreciate my own cat. I'm just like, Charlie, sometimes you have a funny tummy. You throw up on the carpet. You throw up on the floor. 
and I'll be honest, I do get mad at you, but no matter what you do, you could le leap onto my lap and throw up on my chest, and I'll still think you're less annoying than playing into a Yumi, my friend. Wahoo! Oh, dude, I was almost smurfing there! I need to get out. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I did that, dude! <laughs> Let's go for the cheeky bramble. Um, try and mitigate some of that healing. Correct me if I'm wrong here. Um, Urgot's purge, his W, counts as an auto attack. So if he purges, he doesn't get to choose who he purges unless he's hit them with a Q. So if he's Wing me, or if he's Wing like a group of my team, there's a decent chance that he's gonna hit me, and then as such, we're gonna get the Bramble Vest proccing, and then Grievous wounds, right? I'm not 100% sure, but to me, that seems like the smart call. Um, zoom in. Uh, oh, I'm turbo zooming. Okay, two dead. Let's, let's close this out. I don't think I really want to tremendously worry all that much about, like, you know, actually killing them. I'm not in it for the vanity KDA right now. I'm in it for the fat, just the sheer LP gains. GG. GG, well played. Good game. I think I had a lot of impact that game. I don't know about carrying, but, like, I very, well, I think Anivia, like, you know, I think Anivia probably did the most damage in the game. But at the same time, I definitely was the big factor in mid lane winning. And I think that that is, I think I deserve like w at least one honor this game. I'm going to give it to Manevia. She was my partner in crime the entire game. I was actually wrong. Ezreal did a lot of damage. He did a lot of damage. It is what it is, I suppose. So they're, those two are going to honor each other. I would like to think that Anivia is going to honor me. So I'm waiting for the honor. Every dragon, every scuttle crab, a rift herald that I forgot to put down. Camping mid, snowball bot, ignored top, which was a good move to do. Always there in fights, good CS, CLG rotations. What more could I have done? Apart from play all of their games for them like I'm Dr. Octopus, I don't know if there was much more I could have done. Another game, brother. Another so uh, not support. <laughs> we know how that went. Another game of jungle. Oh yes, yes, yes. Oh my god! Don't ban, don't ban Zach. Okay, right. Uh, let's get, let's just get rid of the basic, the basic champs that would shred me to bits. So let's do that. All right, new game, new me. Yasuo bot, Pog, slam him, slam him. All right, cool. Flash down. That is actually kind of big on bot lane. He's not running hex flash either, which is perfect. Big, please from the trash. Given how uh, quick these games have been so far, this may actually not be a video that's intensely long. Like the last ones have been like kind of slogs, and as such, you know, the 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 length of the videos have kind of reflected that to some degree. Like uh, you know, when I have a video that's posted that's uh, not uh, playing until I win, and it's 30 minutes long, a lot of people in the comment section were just kind of like, "Oh no, oh no, what's happened?" <laughs> It's kind of true, and it's kind of sad, but that's what happens. I mean, if the games go smoothly and they go cleanly, man, I don't know. This could be like a three-minute video because the enemy team just surrender at 15 every single time. That would be amazing. It would make this entire thing much faster. Possible win condition here. Come on, dude. Why would you stay? Why would you stay for that? Well, I mean, I'm dead, but yeah, like, either stay or leave. Don't do both. If I got like a, a millisecond for more time there to flash out, or a millisecond more time to like actually flash and W that, that Ariana, that would have been good. I think Cassiopeia hard hesitated there. I mean, it was a bad idea me going in, but honestly, the uh, you didn't see in champ select. Like, they had identified themselves as a smurf and um, were very angry in champ select because their champion got banned. So I've identified them as a problem player. And as such, what do we do with problem players? We babysit them. We try and give them everything they want. If this person wants to say you are the most trash Zach I've ever seen in my entire life, I want someone to cough on you or something absolutely despicable. I am gonna just be like, okay, dude, I understand. I hear what you're saying. I'm hearing you right loud and clear. I'm gonna try my best to be better. I need you to just do you, son. Do you, son. Do you, champ. There's a, this is a 4v3. Fresh is not some, not too brain, big brain there. Like, when he saw that Cassiopeia wasn't coming down, he should have just bit, bailed out. Woo! 
love to see it. Dragging up, not looking good. Maybe you can see about making something happen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, 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 good. Epic, epic, epic. Uh oh. Oh, hold on. Nah. <laughs> nah. Nah, 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 nah. Right, no jungle rope. This should be free. It was. Nice. All right, let's see. Wait for your moment, Ross. Wait for your moment. Okay, I'll do. Uh, passive, passive, passive. Let's hope that Cassiopeia can do something here. It looks like it's likely. Yeah, something. She did something this game. <laughs> oh, thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Something happened. I've been waiting my entire life for this one. Just had to make an alpha move. Okay. We can take Rerald. Yes, we can take Rerald, the dude. The Rerald buff. We just got to pick on mid. So Cassiopeia is out farming the RE. So it's actually not too bad. On top, on top of that, like I don't know, I think I think we might be, we may actually be in for an okay-ish game. Again, I'm not like a major fan of this all, but I'm gonna take this and I'm, uh, oh, I'm gonna go in on it actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. That was a little bit too close to Mali, can dude. Let's get her down, partner. Yeah. I am going to actually abandon ship here, and I'm gonna, yeah, I should abandon ship a little bit faster than that, now that I think about it. But, right, what that is, is that's possible dragon, if I can just move my way down towards that now. Ah, I see what's happening here. Well, roger that. Got it. You can do that to me all you want, mate. It's not gonna do a thing. What? Get out! Don't fight it, get out! What are you doing? They don't have a tower, dude. Oh, dear. Wait, is she TPing? No. <laughs> no. Oh, man, here we go. Actually, Oriana's got no mana, but still, this is a very poor idea. Actually, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. 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 Whatever, dude. You know what? Sacrifice them. You know, I'm sorry. Like, that's probably a bad play from on my part. I, I accept that. However, I was like... I was in preservation mode, and it wasn't for myself. I was trying to, like, because they were collapsing like hell onto that, uh, that Caitlyn. In my head, I was like, she's 8-0. She must be kept alive at all costs. And in my head, I think that was a good decision to make. We have Watermogs one more time. It's just been bought. We had to buy a, an extra Ruby Crystal just to get a little bit of that extra spas. Oh, I still knocked him up, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like that maybe shouldn't have worked the way it did, but... This is kind of awkward for you, isn't it, Oriana? <laughs> um, thank you, Tower, get me out. Um, wow. Okay, another another uh, episode where we get all Ws. Is he gonna all it? He's not gonna all it. Uh oh. Whoop. <laughs> I'm out, dude. We can't keep getting away with this. No, no. Don't continue. No, stop. Stop. Stop the echo. The echo is there. Stop the echo. Don't pull off it. You guys are not doing a good thing here. What is this, man? I, I mean, I don't think they're gonna do it, but that was actually possibly the worst dragon, the worst Baron call I've ever seen. I got it, baby. You can't outsmite me. You. You. I figured that was coming. <laughs> I didn't really want anything to do with that, to be honest. Oh, that's gonna be. It's gonna be. Oh, that's gonna be. That's gonna be. It's gonna be. Gonna be. Gonna be. Gonna be. Oh, it's gonna be. Oh, it's gonna be. That's gonna be. Come here. Oh, dude, that's gonna be. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just end it, actually. End it through mid. Good game, well played. 3, 4, 12. Not as good as last game. I think I had better KP though, actually. But still, nonetheless. Good game! Another only W episode of Fellow Diamond. That'll do the ticket. That'll do the that'll do the job. Oh, beauty. An absolute beaut. Nevertheless, thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy it, please consider dropping a like on it. It helps out 
a great deal on the YouTube algorithm, as well as that if you are new here and you think this is a series that I may be interested in investing myself in just to watch once every couple of days or once every day or so whenever I post it. There's a whole playlist that you can check out at the top right of the screen. There should be a card that links you to the start if you haven't watched the start, if you somehow stumbled in here when uh, this is the 11th, 10th, 11th episode, then by all means. Uh, if not, and you're like, you've watched a couple, they've been in your home recommended, your YouTube recommended, you can't escape from me. I can guarantee if you just subscribe, it'll take me out of your YouTube recommended. That's how that works. But nevertheless, have a great day. I'll see you later. Bye.